and welcome to my channel i hope all of my beautiful and my handsome scorpios out there are doing well all right y'all so we're gonna go on and get into this reading if anything resonates don't forget to like share subscribe and comment let your girl blue flame know what's going on and anything else you need to know about me will be in the description box below okay all right scorpios let's go so let's see who this reading is going to be about messages for my scorpios holy spirit who is this reading going to be about for my scorpios who is this reading about, Holy Spirit? All right, Scorpio. So we got the Seven of Swords in reverse, okay? So this talks about an apology. So someone, Scorpio, this could be an Aquarius. doesn't have to be. But this talks about someone, Scorpio, that wants to apologize, okay? All right, so let's see the situation in. So what's the situation, Holy Spirit, with this Seven of Swords? You could be seeing 777. Seven, seven. What's the situation with the Seven of Swords, Holy Spirit, okay? So we got two cards. We got three cards. Okay. So we got the Wheel of Fortune, the Tower, and then crossing it is the Four of Pentacles. So I feel like someone here has experienced a major Tower moment in their life. Okay. This was unexpected, but I feel like whatever this was, like it blew the roof off this bitch. You hear me? I I feel like this was this aha moment. Like whatever this was, someone here needed to have this aha moment. Okay. So they can have some type of new beginning or so so some type of good luck could come their way. Okay. So I feel like there's been some type of tower. For some of you, this could have been an aha moment, but this could have been some type of shock, surprise, disruption. But I feel like this was also some type of change. Like whatever this 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 tower moment was, whatever this was that happened unexpectedly, I feel like this was also a change. Like this is something that was destined to happen. And I feel like this was some type of faded event here for some of you this could have to do with finances here we got the four of pentacles for some of you this have to do or it could do with someone on you an apology here okay this could be a capricorn this could be someone that was very defensive who wasn't coming towards you who wasn't budging and who was emotionally closed off this is what this change could be bringing in for some of you it could be bringing in this apology from this Capricorn, doesn't have to be. We got Scorpio, Capricorn, we got Aquarius, Leo, Aquarius, Taurus, and Scorpio. Could be from either one of those signs, but it could be more. You know what I'm saying? It's just what I got on the board right now. So there could, and this could be a shock to you that you're going to get this apology because I feel like once you get this apology, I feel like maybe things can move forward now, or I feel like this apology or whatever this is, like this was destined, this was fated to happen. So what happened in the recent past? Messages for my Scorpios. I love you, Scorpio. What happened in the recent past, Holy Spirit, with the Seven of Swords? Because I feel like whoever this was, Scorpio, whatever they did to you, like this person thought they was getting away with that shit, okay? So if this person told you a lie, they thought they was getting away with that lie, okay? It may have took them a while to get caught up, but shit, they got eventually caught. This person that was stealing, cheating, being deceptive, whatever they was doing, Scorpio, this person thought they was getting away with it, but shit. You found out. Okay, so what's the problem? Oh, what happened in the recent past? Messages for my Scorpios. Oh, so in the recent past, some of you guys could have reconnected with someone from your past. Okay, some of you guys, this could have been Twin Flame. Don't have to be. This could have been a neighbor. This could have been you and someone that lived close to you. Y'all could have hooked up, you know. But this could have been someone from your past. I feel like these are memories that you have of this person that taunts you. Someone could be clinging on to the past. Maybe this person feels like you're still holding on to the past. So somebody's skeletons are about to be released from that closet. Okay, so tell us more about this six of cups. Messages for my Scorpio. Tell us more, Holy Spirit, about this six of cups for my Scorpio. Heavy Scorpio energy. Tell us about this six of cups, Holy Spirit. All right, Scorpio. Ooh. Scorpio, one of the skeletons in this person's closet, baby, is that they were married. 
Okay. We got the Ten of Pentacles. All right, tell us one, Holy Spirit. What is the problem now then? Messages for my Scorpio. So some of you guys, what you found out, or one of the skeletons that came out of this person's closet was she, they was married. Tell us more, Holy Spirit. So what is the problem now? Messages for my Scorpio. What is the problem now of this situation? What's the current problem of this situation, Holy Spirit? Ah. <sighs> This person hasn't been able to move towards you or they haven't made any movement. It's the current problem because we got the chariot. Okay, the chariot talks about traveling, movement. Someone who could have went in the wrong direction here. Okay, some of you guys, we're talking about divine counterpart because we got the yin and yang. We got the sphinx here. So some of you could have been on a journey with this person, okay? And this person, I feel like, Whichever path or whichever direction they took, they went the wrong damn way or it caused this person to go the wrong way, not knowing which way to go or causing them to be confused, causing them delays on this journey, okay? So someone here is supposed to take a path with you and they possibly took a path with someone else, which caused this person to go the wrong way. This is someone who experienced a lot of chaos in their life, okay, a lot of stagnation. And this is someone who lost control, okay? So this person you was dealing with, Scorpio, had a lot of skeletons in their closet, okay? And this is why this person is wanting to return to apologize, okay? Because I feel like a lot of you don't found out about them damn skeletons. I know these in reverse. I'm just showing them to you. I feel like a lot of you guys, it's been revealed, these skeletons. Now, all these skeletons ain't been revealed to you, but I feel like for the most part, you knew enough, enough was revealed to you for you could, for you to make up your mind that you weren't going to deal with this person anymore, right? So I feel like even though you may not know the full story, you know enough to where you had to walk away from this connection. All right, so what is, what's the outside influences? Messages for my Scorpios. I love you, Scorpio. So what were the outside influences, Holy Spirit, in this connection my Scorpio shared with this person? What were the outside influences? What were the outside influences of this connection? King of Pentacles. This person was focused on money. They could have been dealing with someone who was money hungry. You know what I'm saying? But they was only focused on money here. They were... Ooh, they were being stingy. They were being stubborn with their time and their energy. A lot of you guys, this person spent time, a lot of time at work. But this is someone who I feel like they were just focused on money. So what are the hopes and fears here? Maybe this person had to provide. This could have been like a father figure. Maybe they had to provide for a family dynamic here. Because the Ten of Pentacles talks about a family, okay? This could have been someone you could have found out they was married. They had a whole damn family. And this is someone who had to provide. They had to take care of their family. So this is someone who spent a lot of time at work. Now, they could have been taking maybe their wife or husband, whoever didn't work, you know, and they were just taking care of them. But those were the outside influences that this person was a father figure, a mother figure, someone who had to provide, who might have been a sole provider for a family here. So what are the hopes and fears, Holy Spirit, of this connection? Messages for my Scorpios. What are the hopes and what are the fears of this connection? And when I get through, we'll go back through the signs, okay? What are the hopes and fears, Holy Spirit? Three of Swords in reverse. This person fears they done did the absolute most, okay? A lot of us went through heartache and pain dealing with these people from the past. And this person feels like that you're still dragging out that heartache. Okay, this person, so some of you, you're still healing from what this person did. You know what I'm saying? Like this person did a lot. And so it was going to take a while for you to heal. So some, some people may have been dragging out the heartbreak a little bit longer, like instead of moving forward, someone kind of lingered in that energy for a long time. And others of you, it could be just taking you a long ass time to heal from this person because of all the F-flip shit they did. Okay, don't worry about your healing process. Everybody's is different. But just make sure you're not lingering in that heartache and pain, okay? It's okay to feel your feelings, you know what I'm saying? But don't linger in that shit, okay? 
All right, so what's going to be the outcome, Holy Spirit? Messages for my Scorpios. I love you, Scorpio. So what's going to be the outcome of this situation? They only came out quick. Two of Pentacles. Okay, so I feel like, Scorpio, after you receive this apology, because we got the Seven of Swords, so this is someone who will be apologizing. But I feel like after you receive this apology, you're going to be going back and forth because I feel like you're really not going to know what to do, okay? The Two of Pentacles talks about juggling. You could be juggling some type of decision, like, do you want to talk to this person or do you not? You know what I'm saying? Maybe you're trying to find some type of balance here. Maybe you are already dating and shit, Scorpio. And you're like, you know, I'm I'm glad you finally gave me this damn apology and everything, you know, but I'm already got my own shit going on. So I feel like when it comes to this person, this apology, like you don't get it. But I feel like you're gonna be going back and forth because you're really not gonna know what to do. I feel like for some of us, this apology gonna come after we way over a damn apology. We're like, man, I want an apology four or five years ago. Now some of you, hey, you may be still willing to accept this apology but i feel like for others of us that's been waiting like i mean it's gonna be long overdue but i feel like this person wants to apologize tell you about all these skeletons they got in their damn closet okay all right so we got virgo we got capricorn leo aquarius capricorn cancer scorpio libra four of pentacles capricorn scorpio Leo, Taurus, Aquarius, and Scorpio again. So let's go to the who did. I ain't gonna roll the dice because I feel like there was enough. Let's go to the who did, okay? Scorpio, you could be an older female or this could be about an older female. Messages for my Scorpio. Tell us more. Who is this reading about, Holy Spirit, for my Scorpio? Scorpio, you could be someone who wears lashes. This could be your person. We got light complexion, 60-65. Messages for my Scorpios. Who is this reading about? Who is this reading about? Okay, this could be about someone who does not have tattoos, okay? We got 55 to 60. Let's get about three more. Who is this reading about for my Scorpios? Who is this reading about Holy Spirit for my Scorpio? All right, Scorpio, we got 65 to 70. We got this could be about someone who wears a watch. And then they can be tall over six feet. All right, you guys, I love you. And until next time, stay blessed.